stayed last night. Could go in there for the cold plunge, maybe. Let's go check on the uh, bride and see how she's going. Ah, how'd you sleep last <laughs> night? <laughs> uh, a bit better than being in the tent. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's cool. Time to go get some coffee. Today we will do 50, 60 Ks, I think it is, to Tunisk. This is the place we're staying. They can house up to 12 rail trail riders. Uh, this is a and b and more. All equipped with all the essential reading. And guides. Pretty neat. Feel like having a game of that if you got enough energy after riding all day. That's the map of where we're going. So we can hang on to one of those. Just a tourist map. Looks pretty cool. And all the essentials are provided. Yeah. So. First and foremost. Let's get some of this into us. Um, the uh, time has come. We're having the Rail Trail Milk Blend in the plunger, and it is time to plunge. Okay, so, so we're just gonna pop that on there, and um, we're just gonna plunge very slowly. There we go. Very nicely. Good. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, first sip. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Best time of day. <laughs> mm. Good? It's good. <laughs> cool. Nice comfy lounge, nice cup of coffee. Enjoy, because in about half an hour, <laughs> you're gonna be sitting on a seat that's gonna bring tears to your eyes. Mm. But we're gonna be having so much Actually looking forward to getting on the bike. Laying down a few kilometers. Thank you. Yeah. You excited about this next section? 
I reckon you're excited. <laughs> Did well in the first section. Yeah, yeah, well. All day I know. <laughs> <laughs> 20 kilometers of our last section was downhill. Mm -hmm. um, and it was good. I enjoyed that. This section is flat and with some hills. I think he even said there was an 800 meter climb. Yeah. Was that right? Yeah, yeah, two, two sections of climbing. <clears throat> yeah, two sections of climbing. So yeah, it should be interesting. Hopefully there's no headwind and yeah, it's just a good day of riding. Um, hopefully we get to Esk at an early-ish time so that um, yeah, we can find a place to charge the bike and uh, Maybe find a good bakery, that might be good. Some donuts or some pies. Yeah. I guess we'll, we'll find out. Um, yeah, what awaits us. So, anyway, um, we'll chat with you kidlets later, eh? See ya. Yeah, bye. <clears throat> I have to say, this is a fantastic little B&B &B that we stumbled upon. I'm super stoked that we stayed here. Um, this place comes complete with a place to store your bikes, just over there in that um, yellow door there. I um, will take you over there and have a look. All packed up and ready to go. Up her last straps. That's the that's the bike shed over there. That's pretty cool. Alright. Is it raining out here? This is where all the bikes are stored. Bike racks everywhere, or two bikes, um, charging stations for all the e bikes. Um, super cool. He even had locks um, on there since nobody's ever stolen any of his um, stuff out of here, but uh, but it, yeah, it comes complete with locks and everything. Awesome. What do you think, huh? Yeah, it's very, very cool setup. Very cool. My new look. Hopefully, it'll keep the uh, little birds from attacking me. All right, we're leaving Montrose. Is it Montrose on Moor or? Yep. yep, we're leaving Montrose on Moor. This is it. Here we are, we're ready to rock and roll. Everything is good. It's cold. It looks like it could rain on us um, and I'm not prepared for the rain. I'm almost wondering if I need to get a garbage bag from somewhere. Oh well, that's all right. All right, well, let's just see how we go. Yeah, super cool shot again of this place. Uh, Montrose on Moor, B and B. All right, we're at the Moor station, and we are. I'm heading out of here. Are you sure that we're going the right direction? That way? Oh, okay. Yeah, sweet. All right, we're heading up that way. All right, take two. Uh, we are now all ready for the rain. Uh, as you can see, we've got rain covers there and uh, my rain covers in here in case I need it. Um, and we are heading that way, let's go. Yeehaw, day two of the BVRT. Conduct. Here we go. We just saw a sign that said magpie territory, so this can be really interesting when they start swooping. 
see if they uh, are in the attack mode or if my little laser beams on top of my helmet keep them away. Yeah, can't wait to see. I just saw one head before me. It looked like he was up to no good too. I wonder what he's gonna do. We'll see. Here comes Kylie on her Cube e-bike. This thing just handles the hills like nobody's business. She's got full Sherpa load on the back and she just does it like it's easy. Oh, we can see some hills coming. Yep, Maggie's just swooping. got a raincoat on and now it looks like it's easing up so now that we've, we're all covered up I bet you it doesn't even rain here we go hill we are gonna conquer you we had some uh, other riders just go up there and they walked that little thing I reckon we can do this let's do it brings back memories of the Brigadoon Day, hey. Yeah. Uh, yep, we even went by a uh, big cattle truck there. Pretty cool. Nice scenery. Well, that was fun. Uh, we took a little detour up to, what was the station's called? Chil Chilton? Something like that, Chilton Station up over the hill just following that wide road that we were on didn't see uh that you were meant to go this way so just getting a bit of um extra hill climb in uh, which is good for the legs uh so we're now back on the track You never want to look a gift horse in the mouth. If somebody's going to give you a free ride, you hop on the back. I think uh, Kylie's little trail name should be the Little Sherpa. Woohoo! This section of the rail trail had a big bridge. Um, if you can see it there on the photo. And, uh, well, the bridge is gone, uh, but they've got a photo of it, so it's not forgotten. And we are going to go down this giant hill here. Be interesting. that view. I think that's the one it was built, 1910. 
How cool is this? That was cool. Huh. This is the sign of that tunnel. If you pause it, you can probably have a read. Pretty cool. It says we're 96.19 kilometers from Wokaraka Station. That's where we're headed. Bikes all along this fence line here. Like hundreds of them. Then there's the arc out the back. Interesting looking place. Wonder if this is like a B and B. Could be. All right, we just fueled up at uh, the coffee shack. Uh, lucky we just got there because it was shutting in a couple of minutes. Uh, this is us here. Getting ready to head to Esk now. Um, I think we're about 18k from Esk, so uh, we'll see how far we uh, or what we feel like when we get there. And uh, yeah, we're making good ta time. This little town. I'm here of Tagulawa. Tagulawa. All right, here we go. Tagulawa Station. Still having fun? I've just been attacked by a magpie, bit me on the ear. Um, he's still sitting over there waiting for me to get back on my bike. Whoa! Man, I mean, it literally bit my ear. I don't know, probably not. Like, those things are savage. How did it know to do that? Ah! Oh! Oh!
There's the coffee shop. That's cool. Heading into Esk. A little bit of uh, paved, uh, paved road. How was the power nap? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Did you actually fall asleep? Uh, yeah, um, I think I faded out a couple of times. I mean, it certainly wasn't a deep sleep, but. Yeah, that's I funny, yes. It was funny when the lady came up and said, oh, look at, um, we've got a big group of kids coming in and I hope they don't disturb us. Uh. <laughs> but I just thought I'd warn you. I was like, I was like, that's hilarious. Anyway, we have gotten a really good charge. We've only been here for probably an hour and a half, but it looks like uh, um, the battery has um, gotten um, like 82% and it was like very, very low um, before. Anyways, uh, we're nearly ready to rock and roll again and uh, get on the road. All right, we are back on the trail. This is Esk Station. How you going? You look a little doughy after that cat nap you had. I'll bet your bum feels good too, eh? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we are at Mount Halen. Going good, hun. Four hours of riding and you're going strong. Looking good. She goes. Leave me in the dust. Horses that way, people this way. Cool. We are at Kaminya. Thank goodness. That was a solid. It was pretty good though. A lot of it was downhill. Yeah. Yeah. Glad you were here though, because it'll 
make our easy, uh, make our ride tomorrow a little bit uh, more enjoyable, not having to go as far. The big push home. There she is. Old Kaminia Station. setting up our tent at the pub just out the back and only ten dollars a night and they've got toilets and showers 